Good morning friends, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Ray and yesterday I discovered something. I'll show you what it is in a bit. Let's first check on the animals. What do you think? I've got the fries. I think I forgot to make them. What about you? Oh, you want that fancy salad? Sorry, no, not happening. At you. Oof. What do you want? Oh. And you? Please. Let me have one cat I can feed. No. Oh. I've got a lot of baking to do. It's gonna be a thing. But it's alright, we'll get there. Uh, so, after recording yesterday, I went on a little bit of a mission with a heap of torches <laughs> and my fishing rod because I broke my shovel and ran out of chicken fish, fish bones, chicken bones, oh my goodness. Um, so that was definitely a thing. <laughs> and I will show you exactly what has happened. Hey, sweetie. How you doing? Sweetie, you won't believe it. I was passing around the beach with Kelpie, the deer you brought me. Turns out she's a she, first of all. I was playing with some hermit crabs, and I found an old baseball. Probably lost by some kids long ago. I told Kelpie, bet she can't fetch this. I threw it towards the trees, and she went after it. She brought it back. Oh, not at all. That ball's gone for good. Poor Kelpie lost track of the ball once she got into the weeds. But she brought back something else instead. What did she bring back? A deviled egg? Holy smoke! That's impressive. Well done, Kelpie. We've got a story quest here for Lee. Shoes on the other foot now. This time I got something exciting for you. What's the catch? This one's valuable. It hurts my soul to even think of parting with it. You're gonna need to bring me an awful lot before I can hand it over. Oh my goodness! Roasted root veggies, fine. Flower pigment, fine. The quartz gemstones. Ouch. Right, we can work on that one slowly. But you'll see, we're grey in quite a few areas. Who it is? The big memoir, the naughty nana. Bubby baby? Don't worry about it. Uh, are we going to be doing a photo? Yep. He wants a photo. The post office, a silo, town fountain, and a house on the beach. Okay, that's fine. But even though I went mad with torches, I made sure that when these people have a quest, the area stays dark. It's just a bit of visual for me. Another geology riddle. What lives in vaults or works against werewolves? Silver! A little short of the gold standard. <laughs> well done. There he goes. He's great. Stuff around here, I haven't lit up extra because he reaches far enough to the coast, I wasn't going to worry about it. At least not yet. Maybe later. But say here. When it gets triggered by, say, her. It's okay, she doesn't have a story quest, it's fine. Oh, we'll take another photo? Oh, no more recipes. Okay, we'll sort that one out too. Do I need to take a photo of your bakery? No, we're good. You're okay. But I was walking along the beach. 
Oh, hello. I'm not going to worry about it. I uh, realise that we go up quite a bit now. What the heck's going on? And when I was talking to our new friend here, you know, I went and explored around here and thought this is great. I didn't look up here. I've got another patch. Pretty amazing. So it does have the ability to be all we let up as soon as we make him happy. So I'm thinking I might move my Lagomorphs up here. I was going to do it yesterday, but I kind of ran out of steam. So <laughs> that'll be probably a thing for today. Well, meet young pilgrim. Have you come to learn more about our emperor? You must understand that he is central to our faith. His Highness communicates directly with the hallowed spirits. Through him we receive their wisdom. Ah, once I was like you, Pilgrim, a young foundling, abandoned by my earthly kin. I wouldn't say I was abandoned. I was left at the steps of a monastery. Its monks raised me. Wow. Under their tutelage, I learned the sacred pillars of our faith, chief among which was the community service, the key to enlightenment. Do you wish to be an enlightened pilgrim? I have seen such waste strewn around this island. Rectify this, and your path to enlightenment will become clearer. Oh. Okay. You don't like litter either. You can stay. Little things, right? Hello. This garden has a funny way of looking different to different people, of responding to each person's inner world as if it knew them. I want to try something. What if you took some photos of the garden? Would the photo reflect your version of the garden? Or something else? And don't worry if you don't have time for this errand, love. It's just for fun. Okay, we can do that, we can definitely do that, and you're happy, but I've got to take a picture of uh, one of these ones, Silo. Let's check this up, and do that one. Alright, yep. And then... You want flowering bush. Is that here? Is it the here? Be these, wouldn't it? So, let's grab these new decorations out and do this. I do love these. And we'll do that. I'm going to leave those there. At least for now. They'll probably get moved later. And we can take it straight back to her. Hey, are you all done? Let's take a look at how they turned out. Oh wow, these are wonderful. And I can tell right away that you took them. I'll hold on to these for later. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, her area is a bit more lit up than it should be, but it's fine. We'll take a photo of the post office. He's alright today. Okay. Town Fountain, House on the Beach. Town Fountain is by the mayor. Oh, she's got a story today. I'm starting to wonder, what is it about this town that draws on those imps? <laughs> I don't want to tell on Allison. Uh, uh, let's go for the wolf bear. <laughs> Clyde? He's such a fine, upstanding citizen. Every election he gives me a sizable donation. There must be something more. 
This afterlife of ours, it's a strange place, full of riddles and hints. I wish I had some more information about those imps, something concrete from an expert. Like an opposition report, or even a pamphlet. Well, funnily enough, who <laughs> great job is this that you found it? The pamphlet reads, Imps are lost, hungry souls. They skitter through the afterlife, pursuing illusionary goals. They are never satisfied. Imps are drawn into our world by pockets of ne negative energy. Where they hunger and feed in an endless loop of unhappiness. That's a sad story. And a familiar one. Does this mean my perfect little town is a vortex of negative energy? I do have to admit, all those details are fussed over that I thought might help me sell this village to the rest of the world. Those things never made me happy, they just made me hold on tighter. I wonder, what is it that I really need? What would make things better? Hmm. Another one getting closer to leaving. Holy smoke, there's so many right now. You're happy enough. You're happy enough. You want me to collect some stuff. I know. I don't want to donate. What do I want to donate? I want a new shell. Uh, so we've got the new shell. We've got quite a few fish that I managed to get yesterday. Legendary one there. I had two of them. I cooked one up. Uh, this one here, a rare one. Another legendary here. And an uncommon. Oh, whoops. Wait, there was some more? Buggies. Oh my goodness, buggies. Well, does that help with... Got the quartz gemstones. That was... Okay, that was what I was worried about. And I've got it all. So all I need is the flower pigment. Which I sold all my flowers yesterday. Uh, and the root veggies. First, let's buy the log. Uh, let's grab that one. Just making sure we're going to have enough root veggies. I'm not going to buy anything with quartz gemstones for a little bit. Maybe the semis. That's kind of cute. <laughs> Precious. What have we got? Happy bird. Joyous imp. Joyous imp. Um, spirit bird. Nope. Nothing. Okay. It's Charlotte sitting there. How can I help you today? Sense the needs of others. You sensed their needs of something, didn't you? Well, you're right. Observe. I'm thinking of something natural. Actually, yes. Exactly what I was imagining. See if I can use my ghostly powers to see what's in your future. Root veggies. Root veggies. Although, that might come in handy too. Let's drop off two logs. Uh, let's put stuff in storage, which would be that for sure, and that, that, yeah, oh, we've got a few things we can turn into bits, uh, quick sort. Now, roasted root veggies of course requires root veggies. I should have some. Uh, I don't have many. Uh, 
must have used them all for cooking yesterday. I can try cook that. Oh wait. Okay, I think we're gonna be good for these. Do I have any flowers in here? I don't think I do. So let's do a quick burn something, and we will burn all of these today, sorry, but the imps are going to starve. It's a lot of root veggies. Now I just need... Flowers. You two in the storage. How many more flowery things do I need? Six. I just need six. Hang on. Yeah, I'm being very focused on this one because it's a massive quest and I want to make sure I get everything. Oh, there's a piece of trash. Now I have flowers up here, the brand new ones funnily enough, so let's harvest, harvest, and we should have enough. More than enough. I'm very lucky he didn't ask for things like wood and iron because I uh, may have used a lot of it on torches yesterday. <laughs> I want to recycle all of these, please. It's complete. And while we're over the side, we've got to get the house on the beach. The cooking quest. It isn't a major one. I'm not going to worry too much if it doesn't happen. I will try. But I might not have all the bits and pieces needed. Where's the house on the beach? Where's your house? I'm guessing she's hiding it. Right, right there. It's a little very, very faded, but I think that's it there. Move. Pretty sure that's her there. Yeah, I can't move. Right. That and that. 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 Just gonna be giving them stuff. Hooey! Look at all this! I've hit the mother load this time. Uh, I mean, thank you kindly for bringing me these much needed provisions. I can't wait to get these items into my stacks. But first, a deal is a deal. Here, to take... <sighs> take this before I lose my nerve. There, ha! Huh? See, I can part with stuff. Just please don't make me do it again. Is it the wheel? <gasps> it is too! It's the wheel! It's the wheel! It's the wheel! We're going to go and drop these photos off here so he can build his... 
would you look at this? Very promising indeed. I've got some investors lined up who are going to eat this up. Look, about the nickname thing. Been thinking of going a different direction. Hear me out. What would you say if my nickname for you was... Drumroll, please. The registered trademark of a major beverage conglomerate. You don't have to answer now. Just sleep on it, okay? Dude, you concern me. What did you... No. <laughs> We will go and drop off the steering wheel, which the captain has been so patiently waiting for. <laughs> okay. Blame Lee. It's hard to get him to get rid of things. Dude. There it is, the fairy's wheel. For weeks the boat had seemed Empty. Empty going. Empty returning. No one cared to visit Cozy Grove in those days. That night, I'd had too much grog. That's for sure. I looked for the island, and I couldn't find it. I'm not lost, I shouted. The island's lost. And then there they were. Familiar rocks rising out of the waves. Too close. Too fast. Oh my goodness. I spun that wheel around and around and around. The boat lurched. No direction. A pointless blubbering thing at the mercy of the tides. Much like me. Oh, that would have been scary. Would have been very scary. I think you're getting. How's your hearts? Ah, I've got a couple more stories from you to go yet. I think for near the end of his as well. Go drop off these two logs. And now let's focus on these. Near a water tower behind something. I love these. Make me happy. <laughs> it's the little things. I love gardens. Okay, he's only got one water tower here today. I'm not seeing the trash. Maybe it's over the other side. Come back to you. <laughs> I've got to figure out what I've got that'll work. Is there a water tower over here? Yes. Now it's a behind something. There's a couple of water towers. Or we just go straight to Charlotte. <laughs> because what? Oh, buckets. <laughs> Very cute. We will just go straight to Charlotte, I think. Oh, it's this way. Interesting. What? Didn't I check down here? Not good enough. 
large memorial statue in, statue in town behind something. Now that's over by the post office. I had to think of what I just gave up to get that steering wheel. I didn't really check close enough. <laughs> I'm a little worried, but it's fine. I, obviously, if it's in my storage, it's there for a reason. Here it is. Near a skull so close I can taste it behind something. There's a few skulls, buddy. And you just opened up a great big portion of the island, buddy. So we'll check around up this way, I guess, for any skulls. There's one there. If it's a behind something, it could be flipping anywhere. Oh, look, there it is, there it is. Buy a supply pile with barbed wire. Well, I know what that is. Hey, buddy. Is it a behind something? No. So it's out in the open, apparently. There it is. Have you just spread out a bit more? Looks like he has. Interesting. You have performed excellently, young pilgrim. You are now ready to join our humble faith. I don't know, sounds culty. All will be revealed to you, pilgrim. Have faith. Take this with my blessing. Henceforth, you are an acolyte of the Emperor's Church. I don't know if I want to be. Oh, but it comes with a shirt. Ah, a robe. Just go dig this up and I'll show you just how big this area is. You light up. Oh, there we go. It's still going. Flick, flick, flick. It comes. Boy. And it's gorgeous. I love it. You want a potato? Well, I now have a potato. We can do that. see it. Let's try that again. We had your way. So yep. Freak out. You freaked out. Come back here. <laughs> try to help you. We're going to take these logs back to Flamey. And then we'll see what recipes we've got to work on that one. Have a log. Now, stuff in storage. What have we got? want pro recipes, right? So that's one. I need ten. Basic. So far, no luck. Uh, down here. There has to be something down here, right? You're a pro. Aha. Okay. Awesome. That's what I was after. I'm going to do these. Stopped by Alison. Where does she want this photo taken? With her. Drop. Drop. Split. Drop. Split. Drop. Split. Drop. Split. 
Uh, no, that split's wrong. Split. 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 There we go. Oh, look at that. You are talented, aren't you? I'm always inspired enough to make all these dishes over again. Cool, dessert salads. We just pick all the stuff up again. There we go. And let's look. In the closet. Where you go. We probably had to be worn at some point just to keep him happy, but not today. Now, Alison, we need to talk. I need to bake. Because the few things that I do not have in my stash, that being one of them. Uh, what else? This one I need quite a few of, so let's craft multiple and let's go four. Alright. Salads always get me the most confused. I think I needed a carrot salad. Fruit salad? It's like, it looks like carrots. Let's make one of them. I want like that reddish looking salad. Whatever that is, this one. Fancy greens. I need fancy greens. Okay. Well, that's not happening today, I don't think, unless I do a lot of searching. Let's. Do I craft multiple of these? I can only craft one because I've only got that much mushrooms. It's fine. But I think that is us for today because there's not much else to do. <laughs> Spirits are being, I don't know, they're taking it easy on us. I don't think Lee meant to take it easy on us, but that's just how it worked out. Now, you guys like bustling? Spooky, bustling. E. Natural. Okay. We're getting something, but I will keep collecting these up. I'm going to go and do the whole moving around thing. And in the meantime, thank you once again so much for watching. I really love having you here with me in the mornings. Yeah. If you're new here, please do not forget to subscribe. It helps out the channel, as does smacking that like button, which I hope you do if you have enjoyed my content. And I will see you next time. Bye!